Hi, welcome to this another episode of uh, uh, News Click, where we are doing a series on the Central Vista. And as we had uh, pointed out in our uh, last episode, that uh, the Central Vista issue has popped up once again. And uh, it is very pertinent to mention that uh, when uh, the entire country is grappling with the pandemic and when the resources must and ought to be diverted to mitigate the disaster that we are actually facing uh, because of the pandemic, uh, our supreme leader and the government uh, actually focuses on the construction of the Central Vista. And uh, as we mentioned, it, it comprises the, the house of the prime minister, new parliament building and many more buildings to come. And at the same time, uh, uh, when the workers should have actually gone back either to their homes or should have been protected, the same workers are being forced to work in the pandemic. So uh, in continuation of that series, today we have uh, Shanaz Italia, uh, who would be discussing uh, what, what is wrong with it, with the entire uh, Central Vista, with the process and with the, uh, or, or, or the way the Central Vista has been designed. And above all, let, let, let me also introduce that Shanaz uh, uh, was, and uh, she is still a film producer who's worked in many films, uh, especially films that were uh, produced by Mira Nair. Uh, so we are very glad to have uh, Shanaz here and she loves to be called as Shani. So Shani, are you there? Can, can we just start the discussion? Yes, I'm here. Oh, great. So Shani, I mean, uh, and, 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 and I remember in, in, in our conversation you pointed out actually, I mean, this is something that pinches your heart because you who, who being a Delhiite, I mean, you say you're a, you're a, I mean, from the core of the heart, you're a Delhi woman. And uh, so what is it? I mean, what is it that you feel is not, not, not good with, with this until we saw this entire project? Because the government boasts and claims of many things that, uh, that are going to change once, once the project is done. See, for, I, I think that various people who you've spoken to have given you facts and figures and numbers. So I'm not yeah. going to go into that. I think what I want to go into yeah. is what, and I would like, as Mukul Keswan had written in his article in the Telegraph, to say that uh -huh. I'm talking about India Gate. Okay. I am not talking about its new avatar, which is the central star. I mean, you know, you refer to the Central Vista when you're talking about any capital city, whether it be London, whether it be Washington, whether it be Canberra, whether it be India, blah, 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 so on and so forth. So for me, the Central Vista, when you mention something like Central Vista, it basically means a parliament, government offices, and a broad avenue. Now, to me, in Delhi, the Central Vista doesn't hold that meaning. India Gate, for me, is what Central Vista okay. is. Okay, okay. Right, so A, I'm Delhi born and bred. Anybody who was born in Delhi in the 50s and the 60s learned cycling at India Gate. There was no way. <laughs> you had okay. a straight road, and if you okay. learned how to keep your balance, the your father or your brother would take you on top of Raisina Hill okay. and push you down and okay. hope that you managed on that slope to keep cycling. Okay. It's where you had your first ice cream. It's where you had chana. It's where, oh, popcorn, this is a new thing. You know, okay. so it's like that. It's part of, it's part of my growing up. Okay. And to so how, how would that be affected? I mean, tell me. I mean, you know. Because I don't feel that there's, there's any change required. Okay. What do you want to do? Yeah. There's a road. There are government offices. The parliament building exists. And for heaven's sake, from when it was constructed to now, we, we haven't increased the numbers of people in parliament, have we? Yeah. I mean, to, we haven't doubled it to 10,000 people that we need yeah. another ginormous parliament building. Okay. Everybody has their chambers. As a, a teenager growing up, I've gone and sat in Parliament, right? At that time, in the early 70s, you could go. You could, you know, oh. a layman could go sit in Parliament, watch a debate. Nobody you didn't have million and one whatever securities that you had. But above all, what India Gate and let me use the word Central Vista since it's what you all use at the moment, <laughs> means for me is the street dogs who live there. Okay. Right? 
we feed animals from Kunoff Place through Janpat to India Gate. Mm -hmm. There are about four of us who combine together, take various sections and do this. And we specifically look after the area which is at the intersection of Rajpath and Janpat. Mm -hmm. Now again, Rajpath, I don't even know whether it's going to have that meaning. Janpat used to be called Queensway. Yeah, okay. Queensway. Then the name yeah. was changed to Janpat. Yeah. yeah. Rajpath was Kingsway. It's still Rajpath. So that hasn't changed. Now, there are lots of... Fa now, as you know, Delhi has a lot of street dogs. What we have been trying to do and have succeeded especially in this area, is to sterilize all the animals as much as we can so that no more puppies come and so the population of street dogs is controlled. They are inoculated. When they are well fed, they're not going to chase people. And really, yeah. you will not find any dog at India Gate chasing traffic, ever. And that's why even on Republic Day previously, this habit of taking dogs and putting them away for one month while they do their rehearsals is really quite idiotic because they don't bother with the people on Rajput. Hmm. They sit in the... <laughs> what yeah, 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 they needed to do was to clean it, was to make sure that the grass is always green, was to make sure that the channels are full of water and clean water not filthy water. Yeah. You don't need to build more yeah. buildings. I mean, it, and, okay. and the other very critical thing is when they talk about the fact, now who do you want a nuclear bunker for, may I ask? It'll be <laughs> yeah. in the other team, right? It's just like... So, uh, uh, it's uh, it's uh, a... When yeah. the nuclear bomb falls, you'll be in a bunker. <laughs> Why? And why does taxpayers' money when people are dying? And I have friends who are in hospital. I have friends who are in the ICU who are on ventilators. And I mean, what words can I use? I can yeah, yeah. appeal. Please don't waste money on where it's not required. What is beautiful? Leave it. Use that money, inoculate people, give oxygen. This is a capital city. We become the laughing stock internationally. Yeah. Uh, Shanaz, I remember uh, uh, actually uh, uh, one of our discussants pointing it out earlier in, in, in a discussion that uh, uh, you may have the, I, I mean, you, you, may, you, you may have the same uh, kind of uh, uh, open spaces uh, still available, but at the same time, uh, you know, you'll, you'll find a, a sniper pointing a gun at you, you know, with all these buildings coming up. So don't you think that was a kind of encroachment on, on you know, the privacy of the people and all? It is. I mean, yeah. Indian Gate is where the hmm. arm army went, uh -huh. right? Not everybody yeah. is a member of Jim Khanna Club. Yeah, Not yeah. everybody is a member of the IIC. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so kaha jao? Not everybody lives in colonies that have parks. Yeah. India Gate is our space. Yeah. It is the general humanity space. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And uh, uh, but the, the, uh, because uh, uh, during a discussion and uh, uh, in one of the, the previous discussions, we we learn uh, that uh, uh, you know uh, you to, uh, you mentioned about dogs. But uh, I mean, if, if you see the trees around, so I think we were able to calculate uh, 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 maybe a maybe hundred different species of birds, in fact, who come and then, yeah. yeah. Absolutely. I mean, we, so, so it's not this, uh, I mean, animals uh, on the ground, but even, even uh, course, on the trees, yeah. Of yeah. course, on the trees and also don't forget the jamuns, right? Yeah. And also, yeah. now, Palsa is not a fruit that many people know about. It's a specific yeah. North Indian okay. summer fruit which yeah. comes yeah. for a month. Yeah, yeah. Month. Right? So eating jamun, eating palsa, uh -huh. you know, all that was part of India Gate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So, uh, yeah, yeah, please, please, please go ahead. Go. No, sorry, sure. all I was saying was that you don't need, um, uh, you don't need <laughs> red sandstone to walk on. You don't need pathways. Yeah, 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 you don't. 
the and that beautiful red sand ah, which true. Is part of you know yeah yeah, yeah. Part, and please let's not forget those absolutely gorgeous lampposts <laughs> yeah let me tell you that chain which they are happily taking out the uh -huh. chain, the black heavy wrought iron chain yeah you have no idea about the value of that uh -huh. You know, it will be yeah. antique and it will never rust. Nor will the lampposts. You know, these are things that people don't know about. They're just throwing it away. It's in a sense what happened partly in Connaught Place when they wanted to uh, remove the, the railings on the balcony. That is also wrought iron. And I lived there and believe me, I did like a Chipko movement on my balcony saying over my dead body, will you remove this? And I'm glad I did because all the ones who allowed that their balcony wrought iron thing to be removed, um, it became rust. Yeah, <laughs> I think you brought an important aspect because you know, uh, most of the people are talking about uh, you know, the design uh, non-transparency in the central vista, uh, air pollution, uh, you know, and all already Delhi's air is choking. I mean, it's it's, it's really uh, affecting the lungs of the people and especially the young ones. And with this new vista, I think it's going to further uh, uh, accentuate accentuate the problem. But yeah, the new aspect about dogs, about animals, you know, after all, they're also part and parcel of uh, of this planet aren't they so uh, but I, i'm what do you think is now required because you have a supreme court dictum they've said no we justify it it's a judicial judicially decided uh central vista that has to go ahead but at the same time there are many voices coming from different corners i mean where i'm mean, which we which i mean which we've never heard in the, in in in, in our earlier uh, discussions. So what do you think should be done to amplify these voices to kind of, you know, bring together uh, many such people so that, you know, we make the make the government uh, listen. I mean, if, even if it's deaf. It's <laughs> Yes, we have to keep chipping away. And okay. that means more civilian voices and certainly more channels like yours. And we also very, very definitely need to get this out in the vernacular, not only English. Okay. Because okay. frankly, it's the languages that reach out yeah, to people. Yeah, yeah. And they have to, you know, they have to see what a colossal waste of money this is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right? You can't build a palace yeah, yeah. and let people die. Yeah, yeah. You know, you can't True. build canals and choke rivers with dead bodies. Mm. <laughs> yeah, true. And th this is what we witnessed. I mean, gory stories, tales, I mean, how, and not one river, I mean, the many yeah, rivers that are missing dead bodies now, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The dams, dead bodies, dead yeah. animals. Yeah. I mean, you know, what are you building? You're building a palace of death. Really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's no yeah. need for that. No need. Okay. Shani, thank you for uh, sparing your time and talking to us. And uh, it's been really nice uh, uh, talking to you, and especially when you brought out the the new aspect of uh, Central Vista. Hey, dogs also listen. They also have a heart. They also feel. So do birds, you know. And I mean, and even for human beings, I think I think it's always a better place to be, uh, you know, uh, in an environment uh, that is, I mean, that, that we are witnessing now, instead to have a sniper pointing a gun at you and then eating yeah. your popcorns and ice creams there. I think, I think that's, yeah, yeah. So thank you so much. Thank Speaking you very much for having me. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank <laughs> you.